Oh my gosh, I'm in love with the jet sound effects, the plane sound effects. Oh, it's so cool. They're just going low fast because they know it sounds cool. What the petunias? This is the Big Light Panzer 57 8.7. This is what Modern's really going to do to the game. It's going to add these light vehicles with some crazy killing systems on board. We have a 57 millimeter Bofors that has the most beautiful muzzle brake right there. An ATGM and then a machine gun that's going to be a coax. Let's check the armor on this thing. Dead, dead, dead. Yes, it will. Oh, it's going to be close. It's going to be able to survive 50 cals from the front. 14.5 millimeter, you're dead. From the top, you're dead from uh, 50 cal. Side, you're dead from 50 cal. So this is going to be a sneaky, breaky tank. Max speed. Wow, that looks good right there. 70 kilometers an hour, but... 531 horsepower at 2,200 RPMs with only a 28-ton vehicle. So let's dive in to the modifications of the Big Light Panzer 57. If I'm mispronouncing, let me know. Comments below. I'll uh, I'll get it fixed up, tip-top shape. And oh my bejeebus. A tow missile. A tow. A tow. I never thought I would ever see a tow in War Thunder. I just thought the tow missile would have more bang or more penetration ability, but maybe, maybe this is an early generation tow missile, only 430 millimeters of penetration, which is still a lot, but I was expecting somewhere upwards of 600 or something. Now, one thing that I noticed is that the, this round was 142 millimeter round has no explosive mass, whatever, none. This one does. And I don't think I'll ever use this one because if, if I'm shooting the side of a T-62, let's go look at one real quick. I won't be able to go through it. And that's like the bee's knees of killing these things from the side. And with only 70 millimeters of penetration, I won't be able to do anything. Now, from the rear, yeah, you're going to be able to kill it. But if he's like this, you won't be able to do anything. Yeah, nothing. He is safe. Now, you, you could detrack him and whatnot but then this little turret's gonna go and then blast your ass to smithereens i'm just gonna use the solid shot and with an auto loader of what this thing is apparently let's let's make sure <laughs> yeah 200 shots per minute what in the world uh it's just gonna be playing um, um uh, what's not mac a wall god what, what's what's happening to my brain smack a mole Whack-a-mole <laughs> uh, with the AP. I'm fine with that. Now, before we get into the action, let's test it out so we know all the systems and how to use them. Now, the tow missile should be a mouse-guided uh, plat weapon platform. Okay, so we got... Why are these all angled? I don't want them to be angled at all. Oh, wow. That fade is beautiful. So not only do we have new sound effects when we're in the plane, ground units have a much better represent, represent, blah, representation of what aircraft sound going and coming towards them. Now we got a, okay, gun testing in three, two. Oh, damn it. Yes, three. Two, one. Check the reload. Oh, wow. We're already ready to go. Now, this round we're using right now is 142. The really amazing thing about this right here is that it doesn't... It doesn't get off target. Look how accurate these shells are. They pretty much hit within millimeters of each other. Now we got 15 rounds. We have a ZSU-23. 
Time to give him payback. We're going to let him get a little bit closer, though. I mean, we can't really kill these things unless we're from behind. Let's let's do a... Uh... Yeah, here we go. Missile launch. Yep, it is mouse guided. Beautiful. Ooh, look how it look how it reloads. Oh, you could actually see some stuff moving inside there. So the missiles stay. They're in that tube, I believe. Okay, let's do another one here. In third person so we can see it. Okay, it just loaded up. It has a cap on it now. And it closes the door. Going for that ammunition. That's some of the, the, the best spaced armor in the world. Do, do they really have that design? Or that like, yeah, we'll, we'll put fuel here. So when they penetrate, the heat round will be uh, depleted pretty much or defeat it. There we go. There's the ammunition. Okay, so now the ZSU is much closer. We got 15 rounds to deal with it. Oh, this is a ZSU-23. I was thinking the 57 millimeter. Yeah, boom. <laughs> wow, that round has really nice shrapneling. We're going to go for the side of this IT one, and then we'll hop into a battle. If not, we'll get into a custom battle. Let's just show it off a little bit more. Right here should be good. Let's see how fast we can just eradicate this guy. Okay, we're driving, driving, driving. Oh, shit. We see him. We see him. Get the gun on target. Start firing. And that's not even zooming in, so we hit his tracks a good bit right there. So, guys, we are in a custom battle. Uh... The queuing system wasn't working at all. On Poland, we're going to try to go to Sniper Hill and see if we can't get some long range ATGM shots and then move on into the city with our 57 millimeter autoloader. Okay, so we're going to have four clips of this ammunition and we're going to load it exclusively with the uh, 57 millimeter AP, no fill around. Now we got a D520 coming in nice and low. my gosh i'm in love with the jet sound effects the plane sound effects oh it's so cool they're just going low passes because they know it sounds cool hmm the shades are a little different or maybe i'm just being weirded out whoa oh oh there he is i thought he i just thought he literally disintegrated now i'm looking for a long oh kpc right here on the way oh shit yeah 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 yeah. okay backing up no we didn't no we didn't just do that now this is arcade battle or something like that so when i zoomed in it it uh it t takes your scope away look see it puts it right to what you zoomed in last we just bounced a um KPZ shot. Youch, that hurts. Okay, so we are back up. We got pretty nailed by that hunter there. Oh, yes. This is going to be a decent anti-air vehicle as well. It only has 45 up, but it's so... Oh, man. That's the max it can go right there. I want to uh, go for a tank right now. We've been going for aircraft for quite a bit. Yeah, but that accurate autoloader is going to be making killing aircraft relatively easy. Now, does it does not have a stabilizer or it does? No stabilizer. Or if it does, it's a very poor one. Yeah, I don't think it has a stabilizer at all. Now, because this is a custom battle, I don't want to cap it and you know these 
the whole point of playing this is to well just test out and have fun with the vehicle so we're not going to go for a cap point but i just saw another how do i say this again big light panzer big big light panzer 57 on the other side so we're going to get up and hopefully get a good atgm shot off on him or we can just drive right up the middle i think that's where he's going right now god those planes sound awesome We got two enemy aircraft converging on us. We're still alive and we're moving. No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> we can't do anything to the front of that. Maybe the lower glazes, but I highly doubt it. Oh, okay. You can never escape the CAS. Not even on the dev server. We're supposed to be testing out new weapons and new planes. And someone's using a MiG-17 with flipping rockets. Now, granted, the rockets are still kind of new on it. Oh, look at the little biplane. So adorable. Yo. Got him, Tango down. That was a ridiculously lucky kill. I got to remind myself that it's mouse got it. I'm, I'm trying to use like WASD. Wow, look at this. Look at this. Beautiful. I wish I could live for more than like 38 seconds. I do apologize. This is just what happens when you do business on the dev server. It's time for payback. We got a hunter right here. We're ready for him. He's dead. Yeah, get out of here, dude. Ooh, this guy is definitely eyeing me out. I can see him already. Oh, this is going to be a good anti-air. So much fire rate. Such accurate fire rate as well. And me playing high. Looks like he's trying to engage me long range. Got him. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is the Nanta here. We got nine rounds left. We're going to get him off long range. And so we can reload here. Oh my gosh. I'm a, I've been alive for quite a bit now. Wait, 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 wait. Never mind. Reloading. Oh, here's someone close to my right. Where is it? There it goes. It's an it's, it's 8,000. <laughs> oh my God. This is the, the anti-air machine. Now let him land, let him land. Yo. Okay, he landed, now kill him. Got him. This thing's not anti-tank at all. This is strictly an, an anti-air vehicle. It has SAMs. Here he comes again. The hunter's inbound. <laughs> now this thing seems pretty decent right now, but the downside is, is that you're going to be versing a lot of American tanks and a lot of Russian tanks. And from the front, this 57 millimeter can't do anything to. So you're going to really have to use this thing's mobility, which it does have, as you can see, to get around to those sides and uh, the rears of the enemies. Oh my God, this guy's like, vive la France. <laughs> I think I'm going to die here. No, no, no. What? I'm on your team. Not again, buddy. Not again. Oh, you're scared of it. Right in the face. Tango down. And he was able... Ooh. Okay, never mind. That's friendly. Lucky he can't do anything to us. No, run away. Those are huge bombs. Oh, man. Those definitely had to be French bombs right there, I think. I... Or maybe they were British bombs. Whoa, 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 whoa. This guy does not look friendly. Oh, that guy does not look friendly at all. Guys, we're going to stop it there. I'd like to show you guys when this thing does come out, more comprehensive gameplay of it. It's just in the, in the dev server. <laughs> You're not going to get that at all. Um, everyone plays on, in those custom battles with their heads cut off. They're having fun. Hopefully when this is released, we can bring you guys a video on this as soon as possible. Again, guys, hope you have enjoyed. Have a great day and peace out.